Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to talk about why I'm not really going to buy the next Call of Duty game, and why pretty much the series is dead to me. Also, by the way, if you ever live in an area where clouds come in and out all of a sudden while recording, it's like a nuclear bomb goes off outside. Like, look at this, two seconds ago it was fine. So, anyways, why am I not going to buy the next Call of Duty now, World War II, I'll consider it eh, not exactly a bad Call of Duty, but not exactly a good one either. You see, for me, what World at War, well, World War II culminates is kind of Call of Duty. It's the essence of giving the Call of Duty community the same thing every year. You know, if you go back in time, you go to COD 4, World at War, MW2, and then Black Ops 1, and arguably MW3, you see this innovation happening, right? COD 4 got the modern era, World at War made the best World War II game, MW2 took modern warfare to a whole new level, and then there was the Vietnam War, and, you know, there's a lot of innovation in the Call of Duty series during, you know, that time, and now it's just, like, it's not, it's either too much or not enough. And World War II is in the not enough category. The map design is, at this point, I'm not just going to call it horrible. It is bare bones, not fun to play. It's not fun to play the maps. Um, the gun selection is very limited because they're putting them in as microtransactions, um, you know, or loot boxes. You try to earn them, I guess. And the rewards you get for stuff like camels, I mean, it has taken them three to four months to make it worth it to get all your guns gold all right who thought it was a good idea to make silver an award for getting all your guns gold and diamond right it just does not make sense it's not that call of duty is not fun to me anymore the actual good call of duty is like modern warfare 2 i have not really had a not fun time except for maybe like getting destroyed right mm -hmm. But I still have a fun time on that game. I still have fun times on the Call of Duties that were actually good and innovative. But the other ones, it's just a waste of time. World War II, any amount of time I put into that game, I feel like is a waste of time. It's not fun anymore. Alright? When you make a bare-bones version of a game that, in its heyday, was innovative and crazy innovative. Right? Not just innovative. Crazy innovative. They knew to fix what not, what's not broken and add things in to make their game better. It was fine. It was absolutely fine. So I'm going to say this. I'm probably not going to make a lot more Call of Duty videos. That is definitely for one. Um, maybe stuff on the DLC because I bought the season pass like stupid, right? Maybe some on, on the, the DLC. But, like, just the other day, my friend Devin was like, oh, they're adding, you know, you got... Demolition double XP. I'm like, why isn't Demolition in the game in the first place? I mean, there's so many good party games like Infected, Sticks and Stones, although they can't really put that in this game. You got Infected, Sticks and Stones, Gun Game, One in the Chamber, those game modes right there. Why are they not in this game? I don't understand why they're not in this game. They would be perfect in this game. Gun Game was super fun in this game. Gun Game is the most fun game mode in this game. And it's not even in the it's not even in the game. It's not even in the game. They just decided, hey, it's gonna be a limited time game mode. What the heck, Sledgehammer? What are you doing with this game? And so I'm just really tired of, you know, and then the microtransactions, my god. Like in case you guys don't know, I don't like loot boxes. I'm okay with microtransactions if it's skins. But if it's loot boxes, get them away from my video game. Why the Sten? The Gavar 43 the freaking whatever they call it nine millimeter basically the german pistol from call of duty world at war okay the mosin the rs even the arasaka those all should have been in this game at spawn launch and why is it that the only attachments that show are sights and extended mags all right the thompson if you put a foregrip on it why doesn't it show the foregrip Alright? I don't understand how they couldn't program that in. I just don't. So overall, I think after playing World at War World War II for a long time, I'm 
I'm just done with Call of Duty. You know, I I skipped out. You know, MWR was a it was fun until they microtransactioned it to death. And you know, Black Ops Three. I stopped playing it way before they added microtransactions, so I didn't get to experience the whole weapon drops. I mean, I experienced a little bit, but. You know, I told myself if World War II was going to do this microtransaction stuff, that I'm done buying Call of Duty. And who knows? They might even make MWR. Or MW2R. They might remake Modern Warfare 2. Doesn't matter. Okay? I don't want to play it. I really don't want to buy it. I might buy it. If it's not like a discount. A super hyper discount. But I'm not going to sit here and support this game anymore. Okay, I might buy it, I'm not making videos on it anymore. Maybe the DLC because I bought them. Like I said, maybe the DLC because I bought them. Maybe if I get this game for free, I might criticize it. But I'm just done with Call of Duty being crap. Compared, like, you outdid yourself 10 years ago. It's taken you 10 years to make a game that still has not conquered your highest point. So, guys, that is it for this video. And the, apparently, the darkness. We're in the darkness. Um, if you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below, are you done with Call of Duty? Do you still play it? I mean, World War II, I might hop on it for a few hours and play with my friends, but I'm, like, done playing the game. I don't like it anymore. And I'm tired of... I'm tired of just the Activision and the studios making games that don't... They don't improve anymore. World War II is returning mediocrity, mediocrity, and if that's what it's going to be, I'm not buying it anymore. So, I'm the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or DTube, Steam It post of whatever I decide to make.